this is the Hardcore Mode Challenge Round 2 between me and Viticus. And in the previous episode, I was uh, fighting those Blaze Rod guys. And uh, in this video, I think I'm going to finish exploring the rest of this uh, Nether Stronghold. And this just looks like that uh, bridge I discovered. You must be in timeout. And it ends here. No, it looks like there's more over there. That's interesting. And so we'll go this way. I wonder if this is like two different nether strongholds. That'd be very lucky. These tend to be. F what is that? These tend to be fairly large. Hmm, that's interesting. Goes into a nether cave. And there isn't a there isn't too much to these uh, nether strongholds. Really at least not when I last got one. Uh, I think that was that was a while back. There's a mushroom. God, there's some loud people in my house right now. Sorry about that. And, oh. I don't know what the point of this is. But I'm going to put it right there. Okay, hold on a minute. Okay, I have not touched the mouse. Here we go. I meant to, uh, like, save and quit first, but I had to suddenly get up and go take care of something. Oh, this is okay, so I can jump in slow sand. Wasn't sure about that. And I wonder what this goes. Is this just the same but well, this is different. I don't remember this kind of architecture. It doesn't really go anywhere though. Kind of needs some work to add some content, but it's pretty cool. It, just these alone in the Nether adds some, you know, a bit of interest. And I don't know how much more I'd like to explore of this uh, stronghold for now. In fact, I think I've done enough exploring. The stronghold, uh, I think it's time to head on back to uh, where I get that sort of uh, nether portal. And I go this way. And this way. Must still be this way. Gotta be to the left here. Alright. And I hear some ghasts, so that's kind of bad news. So I'm probably gonna have to run once I get to the surface or what I call the surface of this nether area. I don't think it's really appropriate to call it the surface, but whatever. Now it's time to run. Oh, keep running. Come on. Oh. Can you still shoot at me? Those guys are jerks. Okay. And we remember how to get back based on these torches and cobblestone waypoints that I left for myself. Hopefully there's no... I don't think the gas can get to me from here. Oh. So I think I should probably make some kind of safety tunnel from here to my 
sort of a portal base so that ghasts can't get me. Like maybe out of glass or something. I do have access to a desert, so plenty of sand. Oh, I hear another one. It must be above me. Some weird nether like gulch. And we're well over halfway back. I think it's, j yeah, it's just uh, below this sort of valley here. And that is the first one I put down. And my uh, iron should be done cooking. And kind of wasted hunger sprinting, but it's kind of necessary in the nether. Oh, that's still... Huh. It's taking a long time. So is this lava. I don't know what's wrong with lava, why it takes so long. I don't know why they just make it go a little bit quicker. I know the reason why it shouldn't go as quick as uh, water, but still. For some reason it just stops at some points and it takes too long to stop flowing. So I think the next thing I need to do is get a diamond pick. So I'll probably be going into those caves where I found the lava to make the nether portal. But first I want to craft my first few blocks. Oh, that looks weird. I haven't seen the new texture for blocks, like iron blocks and whatever. Huh. Well, so that's three points for Mirgaboth. And that's taking a while, so I suppose I should do something else here in the nether. I'm out of uh, cobblestone. There's another brick. Uh, oh, I can't really make a nether wart farm without slow sand, so should maybe go get some of that. There's some fairly close by. It's gonna have to be a wooden shovel. I think you, I think you mine it with a shovel. I've never actually broken nether slow sand before, so I don't really know what you'd use on it. It would make sense to be a shovel, though, to me. I don't know why you would use a pick or anything, but maybe you do, who knows. <coughs> Sorry about that. And... And there's some down here. It'll be kind of a journey to get it, but the iron's still cooking, which doesn't make sense to me. I don't know why it would still be cooking. I'm not even sure how I would get down there. Uh, maybe... I guess a stairway. And hopefully it doesn't take too long. I guess I won't be getting out of the nether in this video, but that's alright. Kind of depend, really kind of important to make that block, those blocks of iron. So, uh, from now on, that's I'll be storing them here, and blocks of gold when I get them. Where the hell am I? Oh, don't tell me that's gravel I saw, not slow sand. Damn. Well, that's frivolous. Uh. Alright, well... I 
guess it's... I know where there's some more back that way, but... That's gonna take too long. Oh, why am I... Forget it, I don't really need to make a farm for nether wart. I don't really see the point. I'll just keep it until I can find some more. Unless you can, yeah, you know, you need slow sand to do it. And there might be some, like, over there or something, but... So I guess I'll get rid of this pick, or wooden shovel. So I really don't need it. It was a bit of a waste of wood, but oh well. And hopefully the iron is done cooking. I must have been like too far away from the chunk for it to continuously cook. That had to have been it, I certainly spent plenty of time fighting those blaze mobs that should have been able to cook it all. total of seven from that much, and ten points for Mirgloff. If I die, I'll be at negative five points. So, eh, I need to make an enchanting table is what I need to do, but uh, I think that's all the business I have to take care of in the nether. Anything I need to leave behind? A stack of coal is probably a good idea. And I don't need any of this right now. Go ahead and just leave that there. Pretty much anything I found in the nether I don't need to bring with me quite yet. So... Alright, except for blaze rods. I would like those. But anyways, if you enjoyed this video, it's loud. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And ch why not check out Mr. Vidicus's channel and his videos. Wow, this is still here. Uh, from his perspective of the Hardcore More Challenge. And thank you for watching.